Hello Pisces, my awesome soul brothers and sisters. I hope you had a beautiful, relaxing weekend. This is Monica with Pisces Moon Intuitive. You want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies um, between you and your soulmate. So that's what we're going to do. First, as usual, we're going to ask what's coming up for you, what you'll be dealing with, facing in your life, and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey. Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate, whoever it is you're thinking of concentrating on while watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. Let's do this. Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Pisces, for Pisces' highest good, please. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Pisces in their life and how is Pisces currently doing on their soulmate journey what's coming up for pisces in their life and how is pisces currently doing on their soulmate journey mm. this one clearly wants to show up as extra message you're trying to make some kind of very important decision it's weighing on you heavily you want to make sure that you make the right decision, whether it's with to do with your job or your soulmate relationship. You feel like you have to be very careful, have to be very strong, not allow your emotions to take over. You don't want to make that decision by being swayed by emotions. You want to make a decision with your uh, logic, your mind. Yeah, you don't want to be swayed by your emotions. Yeah, wow. It has to do with work. Yeah. So whether it's a new job, new business offer, new project. Wow, this is beautiful because it shows that you are very good at what you do. Yeah, this is some kind of message coming to you unexpectedly. Some kind of unexpected message, information of relevance to you. Coming to you unexpectedly, whether it has to do with your soulmate or this situation, you know, please show us what's coming up for Pisces in their life. You are very good at what you do. You see, this is you bringing profit in, very, very diligent at what you do, detailed. You have passion for what you do. Beautiful. You know, please show us what's coming up for Pisces and how is Pisces currently doing on their soulmate journey. Wow, your soulmate loves you a lot, but they don't really make you feel loved. You don't feel loved by them, even though they love you. Yeah, you don't feel like they're meeting you halfway, reciprocating, communicating effectively. Yeah. Wow, this is you trying to make a, two decisions, one about your job and one about your soulmate. Yeah, you don't feel that this relationship is working out for you. You feel disappointed. Yeah, you feel alone in this relationship. You feel not loved. No, you feel like they absent from this relationship, whether physically or emotionally or both. You worry about finances a lot. You worry about uh, your financial future, but you're very good at what you do. Yeah, so something positive on the horizon showing up for you, Pisces. That has to do with your income. Mm -hmm. You feel so alone in this relationship. Yeah, be careful because there are some negative, toxic people around you at your job that create chaos, gossip, drama. Stay away from them. Yeah, do not allow them to drag you into the drama circles, gossip circles. No. <clears throat> Oh my gosh, at times you are doing too much at your job. Don't do other people's jobs. You have to be fair to yourself. Yeah, they're getting paid to do it. Let them do their jobs. Let them finish their workload. Yeah. Yeah, you're going to be celebrating. You're going to be celebrating some kind of big accomplishment at your job or business. Yeah. Whether it's... Um, a new project being successfully uh, completed, new job, 
new position, new way of doing business, uh, new place of employment, it's gonna be good for you, yeah. Yeah, you see, look at this. This is you at your job, at your work. Things will look up again, you see? Things will improve greatly for you financially, yeah. You just need to right now be careful with certain people at your job or business who are negative and toxic. And your summary situation seems to make you feel sad. Let me see. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Pisces and how is Pisces currently doing? Yeah, you overloaded with work. Things will look up again. Look at this. This is beautiful. Wheel of Fortune. You're going to... Uh, you're going to have aha moment, some kind of revelation of significance that will help you see clearly what to do, how to handle any difficult situations in your life right now that are challenging to you. Yeah, you feel alone in that relationship. Yeah, this is you feeling alone. You're meeting somebody new as well. So remember, Pisces, you have free will to decide whether you want to give a new chance to the soulmate you've been dealing with, if they prove themselves to you, that is, or a new soulmate at beginning, or be alone for a while. That's going to be up to you. You have free will to make those decisions for yourself. Your job is showing up again, heavily on your mind. Yeah, so something is changing, shifting drastically. That has to do with your job or business. Judgment, Wheel of Fortune, beautiful combination. Let me see what's going on with your soulmate. This is the soulmate you've been dealing with. Universe, please show us the one that you're thinking of while watching this video. Universe, please show us what is going on with the soulmate of Pisces. And how is the soulmate of Pisces towards Pisces at this time? especially emotionally what's going on currently with that soulmate of pisces this person wants to communicate with you this is them they're not the best communicators no they're not the best communicators or listeners yeah you see this is them realizing that um they don't have much time to make a decision what to do, how to approach this situation, because they're holding a pocket watch here. They have a lot of drama in their life, though, that they need to address. Yeah, a lot of sadness, a lot of fear. Um, this person has a lot of drama in their life, and it's really affecting this connection with you negatively. Yeah. Drama that has nothing to do with you, by the way. Let me see the subconscious position. they in love with you. This person loves you. But you don't feel loved, right? Because if you truly felt loved, you would be happy about this relationship, and you're not. Yeah, they, and this is in the subconscious position, which shows that they clearly don't show you that love. Don't express it. Don't verbalize it. Don't Are not present in your life like they should be, right? If you love somebody, you want to be present physically in their life, right? Communicate effectively, right? Yeah. You don't see that from this person. There's a lot you don't know about this person. You see this? There's a lot you don't know. Universe, please show us that they're holding back. Maybe they're embarrassed. Maybe they don't think it affects you, but it does. Universe, please show us. What's going on currently with that soulmate of Pisces? Yeah, they do love you. They know that they need to show you some kind of affection. Yeah, they can be very cold on the outside, but inside they feel deep emotions. They just don't show them that well. This is them being silent, giving you silent treatments, communicating sporadically, then silent treatments again. This is them needing to figure out where to place you in their life. They can't just put your life on hold. It's not fair to you. Their job, their money is heavily on their mind right now. 
They're not happy with their life. Look at all those swords in their back. You see this? They're not happy with their life. No, there's a lot going on in their life that you're not aware of. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of Pisces. They want to see you. Yeah, this person wants to see you. Ugh. They, they may have some kind of legal issues, problems, yeah, that they need to resolve, whether it's with their ex, whatever it is. They have some kind of issues that are coming up for them, legal issues, yeah, whether they already have it or about to deal with it this year or next year. Legal issues are showing up for this person. Wow, yeah, so it could be with the ex, who knows? Yeah, there's a lot you're not aware of with this person. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot you're not aware of. You see these wings over here in the middle of the card? They're not exactly angelic wings, are they? And you see a snake here, and they're dealing with somebody uh, that they're not happy with. So there's a lot of chaos in this person's life that they need to figure out um, before they can deal with you the proper ways um it's not fair to you pisces your life is being put on hold uh don't let anyone ever do that to you because uh you have the right to move on with your life yeah if somebody cannot meet you halfway whether they don't want to or can't whatever the reason is it's not fair to you to just sit there and wait by the phone god knows how many months universe please show us What's going on currently with that soulmate of Pisces? They're very connected with you. You see, they can't let you go, even though uh, this is such a nightmare right now. You see two of cups, the lovers showing up here. They don't want to lose you, but <laughs> they need to do some work on this. They can't just sit there and think you're going to wait forever. No. Oh, they feel like they lost you or are losing you. They feel depressed, heartbroken, unloved, unappreciated. Um, this person has a lot of issues, unresolved emotional issues from past relationships or relationship. This person doesn't want to lose you. No, but they need to put work into this if they don't want to lose you. Yeah. New soulmate popping up in your life. Now showing up. As King of Wands. I love King of Wands energy. Yeah, you at this particular time view yourself as single, available because you are. You're not in a relationship at this time. Even if you're married to this person. Let's say you're married to this person. You feel single. Yeah, this is how you feel unloved in this relationship, unappreciated. Your energy is beautiful. Whether you're male or female, you're showing up as attractive, independent, emotionally, financially. New soulmate popping up. You're going to decide, Pisces, who you feel is best suitable for you. You're going to make that decision for yourself. We're going to go into your extended reading. Obviously, we're going to ask about this soulmate, but also new soulmate entering your life that just popped up as King of Wands. First, however, we're going to ask about this soulmate's true, genuine long-term intentions and plans for you at this time what are they planning long term then we're going to ask what they currently hiding from you whether purposely or can communicate for whatever reason but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good and of course at the end we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle the soulmate connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life including new soulmate entering your life, the king of wands, energy, new chapters, new beginnings in your life, also your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So Pisces, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below, and I'll see you there. Love you guys.